is one of the first things I usually do in the morning, which is usually getting up out of bed and then writing a few video ideas down, as well as planning them out. Here, let me show you how I do this. For example, this video will be about gardening. This will likely be the one that comes out on the 28th, the big garden tour, so stay tuned for that and subscribe to the channel for that. This is one of my favorite times of the morning. I like to check on the chickens. Now, as of recording this right now, it is the last day of school. Today is June 20th, so that means that when this video comes out, school will already be over, so yeah. More highly edited videos on the way, a lot more, actually, in a higher volume. Well, looks like there's some chickens that didn't get out. It's actually quite a normal thing that chickens actually will do since, well, they really are just waiting for me to bring them treats, so they basically wait it out since they know I'm the person who gets them treats. Now I feed them. <laughs> this is what really drives the chickens out of the coop, so if they're waiting for something, I would always bring this to them, so that way they can get out of the coop, and well, there you go. There you go, there's chickens out of the coop, so now I can feed them treats easier. Now there's this black copper marin chicken that really does enjoy escaping the thing. The other black copper marin is currently in the box. I'm going to be dropping a video on that one in a pretty short period of time. So yeah, stay tuned for this. And yeah, this marin is definitely special because, well, she obviously just waits for me to give her treats every morning. As well as a few other chickens like a barred rock and a buff warping pen. Now let's check on the plants and how they're doing in the garden. Uh, let's check on the plants. Sorry. So, the potatoes. We usually like bury them as they grow taller and that's usually what you do. As you can clearly see they're definitely at a sizable height right now. And let me check on the garden really quickly before my bus gets here. Alright, we're gonna a quick garden really quickly. Alright, looks like everything's doing good. Alright, I'm home. The school year's over. Let's go. Alright. Let's check on the chickens. Yeah, we have a broody marin now. And well, she is now brooding our chickens. It's not cute. We got someone to breed the chickens. Yeah, that's that's good. Right. Check for eggs. All right, sweet. So oh no, that's summer, not the broody chicken. There's summer. There's um. Oh my God, yeah, that's one of the chickens moved on the pet block. Right here, this is Rogue Cluck. And this is Avro. Yeah, rogue cluck is definitely kind of rogue. And this is summer. Much more tame than rogue cluck. Seven o'clock, I last filmed at about like one, so I feel like the six hour gap. But my camera's battery died. Like so, you know, it's time to give you all a garden tour, you know. I'm gonna be dropping one on the 28th. It's gonna be your next garden tour. It's gonna be a late June garden tour. It's gonna be dropping on the 28th, y'all, so post notifications on for that, because, well, It'll be something you're not going to be willing to miss. So yeah, be sure to subscribe to this channel for more content about chickens. And well, comment, I subscribed, and I'll try to respond to as many as I personally can. But chances are, if y'all leave, leave me, if y'all leave me like, if y'all leave me like, I don't know, like, like 8,500 comments, I'm probably not going to be able to read all of them. So yeah, that'll probably take me prolonged periods of hours. Oh yeah, our basil is flowering. I think we, I don't know, like rip them out, but still have to get confirmation for that. All right, so I think these are like the, yeah, here's some cucumbers, I think. Now, bro, these are the cucumbers right here. They're growing. Look at this thing, it's huge. Cucumbers growing. And the cherry tomatoes are there. <clears throat> and there's a basil right there. Yeah, I already showed you. I don't know what these are off the top of my head. These are definitely zucchini. I really do enjoy good zucchini bread. It's, it's pretty amazing. If y'all and I, y'all can show you how to make zucchini bread. But it's definitely something that y'all can grow easily. I completely forgot what we're doing over here. But I know in one of these rows we're doing like tiny pumpkins sort of link away. 
You know what I mean there? So yeah, here are some more plants you might enjoy growing. You know, once I get the names of all these plants, which I will tomorrow for the 28th tour, y'all will get um, the information that you need. But yeah, the 28th is going to be a big day. Big garden tour, the whole update thing will be around here. All the stuff you like haven't been able to catch up on, like growing stuff too, that'll all be dropped on the 28th. And here's some peppers too. So I think it's a little early to be getting this sort of stuff. Like last year we didn't actually get like a good garden harvest until like, I don't know, like early August, sort of. But here we are in late June, mid, mid late June. Yeah, the birds keep on picking off these uh, blueberries, like we're, we're losing blueberries. So we still need to cage this entire thing up right here. So that way nothing gets in here. And something trampled the fence. I think something was in the garden. But I didn't do that. Cause I always walk over the fence, not on the fence. Time of day that I usually like to go outside and then respond to people's comments on my hand. It's pretty fun to do since while I'm outside and while I'm making the most of my time before dinner gets here. It's one of the best things that you could do if you're on a YouTube channel since, well, you don't want to be sitting on your gaming chair all day long. I mean, like, seriously, going out on the hammock, it's kind of hard because, like, I can't keep it balanced, but it's still pretty fun either way to be able to just respond to people's comments on a hammock outside while still getting some fresh air. Here's me ba making a basic response to someone who left a comment on my latest video at the time, which was about, um, don't do this to your chicken, part 3, so if you want to part 4 to that video, 250. I'm going to quickly show you some stats now. Compare these to what you see when you're watching this video, but my latest video was posted today. My chicken will enjoy these treats has 52 views, this has 78 views, and this is 109, this is 242. So yeah, compare this to whatever you see, and not everyone can see this, but like, here you go, 4.8 thousand views. 244 in the last 48 hours. Alright, that was it for this video. If you did enjoy, like and subscribe to the channel, and I'll be editing this tomorrow morning.